Happy Monday to you. Happy <laughs> Monday to you. Happy Monday from Texas. Happy Monday to you. What's up, guys? Well, as you saw, we got our delivery done yep. down near Houston this morning. Deadheaded up to Waco because I had something in the mail that I wanted to get. Yes, and which didn't put us far from where we are picking up in the morning. Yep. So, what was our total deadhead? Like two, a little over two hundred miles. Well, uh, that was to Waco. Yeah, and then another and then sixty, 60. miles. Yeah, so. Oh <laughs> so it would have been less if we didn't deadhead to Waco, but yeah, it wasn't right. too far out of the way though to go to Waco, and yeah, Jason had ordered something he wanted to pick up anyway. So and we got to see Mama Crafty, yeah, and see Scully her. and Dexter. Got to see them for a minute. It's one o'clock here local time, so we have the rest of the afternoon to just chill and chill. get ready for our pickup tomorrow, which you'll find out about in the next clip. I After will we get it picked up, probably lay down early tonight. I'm tired. I didn't sleep well. I mean, I, I can, you kept getting up last night. I slept on the outside. We, yeah. We take turns sleeping on the inside and outside of the bed. And I don't like that arrangement. <laughs> I do. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't mind sleeping on the inside or the outside. It's just nice sometimes to sleep on the outer side. Well, but the, the reason I like sleeping on the the outside is in case someone tries to break into the truck, I can jump into action and open a can of fat boy whoop ass <laughs> yeah <laughs> but when you're at an rv park that's really nice and most likely there's a no, I, can't, no, I can't use that excuse right exactly that rv park was nice i'm glad we were able to stay there for the weekend until we could deliver today yeah yeah it was pretty good yeah uh, you know nice quiet place mm -hmm. people not a bunch of rowdiness. You stink. Oh, we didn't. <laughs> so if you saw the last vlog, we were talking at the end about how Jason had to go get pellets for the Traeger so we could grill, which didn't oh, turn out gosh. so good. He took an Uber. Oh my gosh. And the same guy that took you was the same guy that brought you back. Yeah, because like he parked in the parking lot, and on the way there he drove like an idiot. But I was like, yeah, whatever. You know, I drive like an idiot too sometimes. So I'm like, whatever. He got me here. I got out, went and got my pellets, came back out, ordered the lift, and he was sitting in the parking lot. So, of course, he got my ride. And while he was coming over to pick me up, he got cut off by some guy in a pickup truck. And so when I get in the car, he's like, he's like, them dumb rednecks and talking <laughs> crap. And I get in, he starts pulling off. And then like, all of a sudden he stops in the middle of the road, gets out of the driver's side and stands up and was like, F you and Merry Christmas to you and mother ever. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God, this dude's going to get, get us, get in a fight. Like right when we're <laughs> I'm getting a ride and then oh my god like the whole way back he was just talking about how much he hated rednecks and big pickup trucks and how they're compensating <laughs> for little wieners and I was just little did he know we have an F450 yeah I'm like <laughs> I'm like oh my god dude you're like dude I have up. a pickup truck <laughs> yeah, uh, and then and then he was like uh when we got to the RV park I told him I'm in that big white truck right there and he keeps, he drives right past it and he thought I was talking about a little white pickup truck. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, dude, that's not a big truck. Yeah. I told you I'm a truck driver. So that, 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 that dude was, I gave him a tip going there, even though he drove like a jackass, but. You didn't give him a tip for the I didn't the give him a tip. Back. I didn't give him a bad review just cause. Yeah. I'm sure somebody will. <laughs> and I wasn't going to be the guy to do it. And I'm sure he'll probably lose his job really soon if he. <laughs> <laughs> acts like that with customer in his, in his ride but it's just gonna get worse the closer to christmas i think 
Can more people be out and yeah. shopping? And Some, oh somebody's going to report him. Oh my gosh, that's so somebody funny. will. Jason told me about that because I stayed back at the truck because I was editing while he yeah. went to go grab those, yeah. and then he told me when he got back. I was like, oh my gosh, that's crazy. I'm glad I wasn't in the the car because I probably would have said something to him about it. She would have. She would have. She would have said something. So. Yeah, but man, so yeah, had a nice weekend there. We are ready to get running again. Yeah, we only got like what two and a half weeks till two christmas so and two weeks and a couple days they're back here i don't know if you can hear them they're back here wrestling they're getting each other are you getting sissy are you getting her dog wrestlemania <laughs> they always like to do that when we're sitting back here filming yeah oh, oh. You, oh. it barks right in her ear like look at me play with me play with me <laughs> abby's butt stinks she does i need to clean her uh. anal glands those little things you gotta like and it squirts out and gets in your eye and it, it gets all over the place yeah. it's pretty bad it is it you we take them outside for that yeah yeah but, but yeah so that's right. what's up guys we will catch you tomorrow after we get after picked we up pick and tell y'all about the load cool Coffee, coffee, coffee! Happy Tuesday! I might make myself look as tall as she is. <laughs> or I can make myself look lower. Yeah, go a little. Oh, nope, too. <laughs> oh, the things that are entertaining. I know, right? Got to find entertaining things to do on the truck. <laughs> but we got our load picked up. Man, yeah. that was a quick one this morning. Yeah, we picked up from this place before. And usually it takes about an hour and a half to get loaded at that place, but. Um, we got, uh, it was like 45 minutes, yeah, 15 minutes. Even, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, gosh, it was quick, quicker I, than I usual. Work, I got everything loaded and we were out. Which was nice. Which so was what nice. are we doing? So we picked up in Texas and we are heading back to California. <laughs> yes, back to California, but we're going to Southern California this time. We've got three pieces at 1500 pounds. And it's a little over 12, almost 1,300 miles loaded. We sure do go out there a lot. We do go out to California a lot. We like it out there. I mean, we like going out to the West Coast. Uh, as much as I rag on California, I, I, there's a lot of great people out there. I grew up out there. Jason was born in California. Uh, I was born and raised in California, and I moved to Texas when I was like 20. Yeah. So. 19, 20. And I've been out in Texas ever since. And I, it, <laughs> during my younger years, I was I always was like, oh, I'm gonna go back to California one day. I can't wait until I can save up enough money to move back to California. And now I'm now that I'm older, I'm like, I don't ever want to go back. Yeah, uh, especially as all the shutdowns and stuff they're doing right now. Oh gosh, I'm glad I'm not back. <laughs> yeah, I, I always wanted to live out in California too, <laughs> but it's like now I'm like, it's too expensive. Too expensive. It's, just, I, it's nice to go out and. Be able to visit and yeah, see the scenery beautiful, but beautiful state but uh, i wouldn't want to live just because it's just the price of living there is just crazy yeah taxes and fuel and just everything uh -huh. all I, I like cheap texas yeah you, you, not like wherever we're not there that often but <laughs> you can live really cheap out here in texas oh yeah yeah, yeah. which we are still in texas we just got into um a little Little little, little we're on the back town. road. Maynard. Maynard, Ma Texas. Menard. Menard or Main. Yeah, what, is it what Menard? Is it? What, it, Probably what Menard. does a pirate say when you kick him in the 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 nuts? What? Menard. Oh, Menards. Menards. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, this little Texas town. We're on the back road. The uh, 190. We'll be on it for a while, till we hit the 10. Yeah. And then we'll be taking the 10 all the way across. All the way across. Yeah. No, actually, we get on the 8 in Arizona. and we. Oh, yeah, yeah, Because yeah. we're going southern, southern California. Yeah, right. That's so. right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, I'm, I'm excited. Yeah, it's a good load. And good load. Hopefully, we won't sit in California like we did over no. Thanksgiving. I no, think we'll get out pretty quick. I, I think we'll get something out of there this week pretty quickly. I checked the Landstar online to see how many express trucks were out there in that uh, southern California area. And there's 
only like three other trucks there right now so and none inbound no that none, we can see not, yeah it's been kind of wonky like it i don't think it's completely accurate sometimes what it tells us it gives us an idea you know but it I don't think it's completely accurate. Yeah, so. and people ask, you know, oh, oh, you can see the other trucks. So, yes, we, we have what's called Landstar Online, and we can go on there and do a truck search. You can set the criteria for what you want. We yeah. always usually do just express trucks, but yeah. you can see tractor trailers if you want. Flatbeds, it depends on what criteria you put. Yeah, 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 we can see all of that, but we don't need to see all that. We're more just worried about how many express trucks are out there because yeah. they're the people that are going to be probably doing the same kind of loads we are. That we're going to be kind of, <laughs> yeah, so. Well, it just gives you a kind of idea. It's not yeah. so much I want to know who's out there. Or no, what's, but it, you, it, you don't know who it is. You, you don't, can, you, you don't. It doesn't tell you who it is. It, it just tells you what kind of truck it is. What kind of truck they have, if they have lift gate, if yeah. they're reefer, how big their box is, but um it's it's just a small useful tool that we use yeah, yeah. just to have an idea of Get, you know it kind of lets us know oh there's not a lot of trucks out there there's not many inbound trucks that must mean drivers are either getting out real quick or there's not a lot of freight going out there yeah. so it, it just kind of gives you an idea it's not like a surefire yeah way or, no but yeah. yeah but that's what it is yeah, yeah we can do that one of the tools. And... i know with panther we had a little bit of something like that you could see the load board count mm -hmm. you couldn't see truck numbers or anything like that but you could see like what your position was on the load board and how many trucks were ahead of you and how many trucks were inbound oh, i don't know if you could see inbound i don't think you could see inbound no no you can see how, inbound no, it was just how many trucks were actually there and, at the at that current time and, and it was a real generic thing like they told you um uh, on the website it told you how many loads that city was doing in the, like the last 30 days mm -hmm. or but that's through through them it was not like the all the trucking companies i was just no, the no, average yeah. of what just panthers loads company. were in yeah. or out of yeah, there yeah, and yeah yeah. Yeah, no. yeah and i think they still have something like that too. i think they do yeah i've heard drivers talk about uh they do it a little bit differently mm -hmm. they call it different things now but it's all yeah. the same yeah it's nice just a little tool that we can use yeah and... fedex can't look at anything Oh, really? They cannot see what, what trucks are oh, wow. in the area or inbound. Unless you're like a big fleet owner or something, then you can, you can they get a little trucks, bit more, yeah, yeah kind of access huh. to it. But hmm. Interesting. They all got their own different little way they, they do things, and none of them are perfect. <laughs> no, none of them. <laughs> We've always said that. But I'm going to take over now, and we're going to let these babies out do the same old thing do we always do. Do the same thing do. we do every same single thing, day. Every Film day, up every front, day. let the dogs out, <laughs> film them pooping. And... <laughs> I don't ever film them pooping. Oh, maybe yeah. sometimes. Maybe we know. should. Maybe, maybe that who wants, to, who wants to see the dogs pooping in slow motion? <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Black yeah. and white or, or color, you know? <laughs> you speed ramp it. Speed ramp the poop. <laughs> Do reverse and back out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. All right, we're done. We're done. All right. We'll catch you guys after we get delivered tomorrow, probably. Cool. Peace. Deliver it done. Happy hump day, y'all. Oh, man. What a day. It hasn't been that bad. <laughs> it hasn't. We're both just tired. Yeah. <laughs> we got there so early this morning, and they didn't even get there till like, they said they were going to get there at 9. Yeah. The lady didn't get there till after 10. And yeah. 
Any of it. I told you it'd be ten o'clock. I know. I know. They say nine, and then they make a, and then they're like, "Oh, I'm sorry, I had to drop my kid off at school." Or, yeah, but all the schools are closed in California, right? Yeah, or yeah. are they open? I don't even know. I don't know. I know some of them are. <laughs> but it is done, and we got a call from an agent that we're probably going to have two loads. Yep, picking up from the same place, going to different, two different places. places. Yeah, so we're waiting to hear back from them on it. Um, got some deadhead to do, mm -hmm. but yeah, I mean, uh, the loads we'll, are paying well enough to cover the deadheads. So. Yeah, yeah, it should be. I mean, when you pick up two at one place, it's definitely a lot better. Yeah. So. Makes it a little bit more worth it. Yeah. But we, after we delivered, we uh, came to a rest area. We've been here, I don't know, what, an hour? Maybe a little over an hour? Yeah. And he had just called. We were getting, I was getting some paperwork done and just, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm tired today. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we were just like, eh, uh, eh, eh, eh. But <laughs> I'm excited about the two loads. Yeah. I'm excited about them. They're not a go yet, so I'm not too excited. Yeah, which you'll have to <laughs> we, wait till the next vlog to find yeah, out about Yeah, we got to hash out all the details. Are we picking it up tomorrow? Are we picking them up Friday <laughs> and running them over the weekend? Or, you know, whatever. So we got to hash all that out. I think the first delivery, they don't receive on Friday. So I if we, it was every other Friday. It's like every other Friday or something. But, of course, yeah. our luck, it will be this Friday that they're not receiving. Yeah. So <laughs> we'll have to verify that. Um, and then get into the next one. It's so, yeah, it, it, a lot of logistics stuff that we got to figure out. Yeah. And it may not work out the way we get it all worked out. You know, that's just <laughs> expediting sometimes. Yeah. You know, we, uh, things, wrenches get thrown in the mix and... Um, things don't work out as planned a lot of times. Yeah, he does. I know we've talked about that a lot and with expediting because things just never work out and you really have to have a thick skin to be able to just go with the flow sometimes. Believe me, I am gr Mr. Grumpy here. <laughs> <laughs> I get pretty mad sometimes yeah. and I have to put myself in check but yeah uh, it, it, and we've been doing it eight years and i still get pretty frustrated but i mean i think i've kind of gotten better a lot better she's loud today she is loud today Let's... but uh yeah you have to be uh willing or able to adapt to change that's for sure because Things always change. Things happen. It, I mean, it's nice when everything goes smooth, and there are a lot. Yeah, yeah, it's nice smooth, when it goes smooth. But, but some, there's just always Like this morning, you know? you know? I mean, we, we got there at like 5.30 thinking, oh, they'll probably be open by 7. No. No. <laughs> 5.30 to 10 o'clock, we sat around and waiting wait, on waiting them. On, and, yep, so. But, yeah, you know, but that's just something that's part of the job it really is and you got to be willing or that's you have to have that in the back of your head and that's a lot of the reason like like we've said you know we don't like to jinx ourselves by telling you about loads before we pick them up but it's also because anything could happen like last week we had the one load but it canceled yeah, so if yeah. we would have you know why tell you all about a load if we're not even have it on the truck you know yeah so I, I've noticed a lot and this is this, from our eight years that we've been doing this and I know some of y'all that have been doing this way longer than we have <laughs> truckers are kind of looked down upon mm. like it, people don't care about our time truckers are almost looked at like we're such a profession that you know there's a lot of really professional truck drivers out here yet so we're, we're treated so, like so, so low on the totem pole yeah <laughs> like we're all that trashy trucker stereotype and you know it, it's kind of crazy it is crazy it's not it, every it be, place but being such an essential job to the economy and life and stuff you know not that we're special you know we don't no. It's a job we picked, and that's what we love to do, and we don't think we're anything special than anybody else, but, you know, it's it's a prideful job, you know, for sure, and 
I'm rambling, ain't I? <laughs> See, that's how tired I am. <laughs> I it, it's just kind of, it, it, it makes me think sometimes, you know, when we got hours and hours of driving, you think about oh, this gosh, stuff sometimes. Oh, gosh, you think about all kinds of yeah, stuff. you yeah. got nothing but time to think sometimes. Nothing but time to think about stuff. <laughs> when you're driving. It's funny, like, I'll be on my shift, and I'll be thinking about stuff, and then when Jason gets up, I'll be like, blah, 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 just rambling off all the stuff I'm I thought about. I'm a woman, I just woke up. All the stuff I thought about while I was on my shift. And <laughs> <laughs> or he'll do the same thing, like, like when I get up, he'll start yeah. telling me what he's thought about yeah, on the, yeah. his shift, and you got to yeah. try to remember it all. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sometimes you got to text each other and remember, remind you, remind you what you want to talk about. But yeah. we are going to go ahead and end this one here. Yeah. We will pick up the next one, and you'll find out all about these loads if everything goes as planned, and we get those. So stay tuned for that. You have anything to add, Missy? Are you liking your advent calendar treats? They're yes. loving them. Yes. They yes. get one every day. Yes. yes. <laughs> All right. You have anything else to add? Nope. Nothing to add. Nothing to add. Until uh, next video. See, see how these next two pan out. Oh, yeah. I've decided, and you probably noticed in uh, this video, I started, we're going to be doing Christmas music in them. December. Oh, yeah, December. yeah. Yeah, I spent a couple nights looking, trying to find some really good ones. Yeah. So hopefully you guys like it. Hopefully them. you like it. It's hard finding music that we're allowed to use on our YouTube channel. <laughs> I mean, you can There's use any copy. music you want, but yeah, you get copy copyright strikes, and you can get your channel like banned, and yeah, if you're not careful with the cancel banning everybody these days. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully you enjoy the Christmas music on the next few vlogs for the holiday season. All right, well, we'll right. end it then. Thank All you right. guys as always for watching and subscribing. Until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. Peace, love, and expediting. Thank you for watching. <laughs> <laughs>